is so called part C. It says the equation of a line is given as, and it gives the line. The line crosses the y axis at Q. Determine the coordinates of Q. First of all, we know that when we have an x and a y axis, and then we have a line, whatever that line is, let's say, oh, let's say this is our line. It crosses the y axis here. Wherever it crosses the y axis is where x equals zero. If you said zero, you would be right. All right. So it crosses the y axis at zero. X equals zero. So we have y axis, x axis. Let's use this as our line. And it crosses right here. Alright. Now. When x is equal to 0. That happens at q. Wherever it crosses the y axis. So 0. Over 3. When we substitute here. x over 3. We know that x is 0. So you write 0 over 3. Plus. Y over 7 equals 1. 0 divided by 3 is it's not 3, it's not 1, it's 0. So 0 divided by 3 is 0. So y over 7 is equal to 1. So in this case what is y? Work it out and you get alright I can put 1 over 1 here, multiply both sides by 7. If I multiply by 7, 7 cancel 7 and leaves y alone. Then I multiply the right hand side by 7, so we see that y is equal to 7. So the coordinates of q are where x is 0, y is 7, so we can write it down like this 0, 7. So 07 would be the coordinates of Q.